According to Power and Rothkar, forest conservation involves the upkeep of the natural resources within a forest that are beneficial to both humans and the environment. In general, forest can be defined as a land with many trees. The root of forest cannot be neglected and grow in many places around the world. The ecosystem within the forest can be classified into fauna or flora. Coniferous forests, deciduous forests, and tropical rainforests are the examples of forest bio around the world. Other than that, forest is our closest relative and it is relatively closer to our daily life. For example, forests provide a multitude of products besides timber, which have an important value in the global market, even to make our life better. Therefore, this is the reason why we should pay attention and put effort in the case of forest conservation. Gao, Hadblum, Emilson and Nielsen believe that biodiversity conservation is a key objective for sustainable forest management but the multidimensional and multi-scale character of biodiversity renders full assessment difficult at large scale. From a different angle, forest conservation in protected areas such as national parks can preserve existing carbon stocks where natural disturbances are rare. Forests have many importance, and then the first one is it will maintain the health of the people. Like many people will come and exercise and hike at here when they have free time. Okay, next is forest can cover the land, soil, and the water. Then it will it will also regulating the regional climate because here got uh, here is very fresh, and then it will supply the sufficient oxygen. Forest will also provide the raw materials. Uh, for example, like this, Tama Mini. It will provide the herbs for the medicine purpose. To help the conservation of forest, it's really important to keep the forest clean. Yumanagoiga 比较没有那么有效果啦像是它的腹力值啦腹力值做消啦像是我们这样子走的是吗它的血糖会降很多咯像是我们这样子走的是吗它的血糖会降很多咯像是我们这样子走的是吗它的血糖会降很多咯像是